Welcome to Java EE Programming Course. If you are a Java developer and would like to enter the web development field using Java, this course will help you. Java Platforms Most of us know that Java has three basic platforms. The first one is Java SE, which we can use to build desktop applications. The second platform is Java EE, which we'll cover throughout this course. We use it to build web and enterprise applications. The third platform is Java ME, which we use to build mobile applications. Course Objective This course's main objective is to learn about Java EE, Servlet, JSP, JSTL, and JDBC. This diagram shows the technologies and frameworks that exist in the Java EE and is used to build web applications. In this course, we'll talk about Java EE architecture and technologies, then we'll have an introduction to web development. After that, we will learn about the servlet and JSP technologies in detail. We'll then include comprehensive examples explaining JSP, Servlet, and JDBC that covers all the course's material and provides practical experience in web development. Java EE versus Spring Many of you are familiar with Spring Framework, especially if you are looking for a job. Almost all Java work opportunities require Spring Framework knowledge. And there always arises a question. Should you know Java EE to be able to work in Spring? Or is it possible to work in Spring without learning Java EE? Java EE is mandatory for web development. And it is a must learn to be able to work in Spring as Java EE is the basis of web development in Java. It introduces Java's two core technologies, which are Servlet and JSP, which frameworks like Spring, JSF, or Struts rely upon, as the Servlet and JSP technologies are used to develop the web components. That is why it is important to first learn about and well understand Java EE and learn about JSP and Servlet in depth. After that, we can learn to work using Spring MVC, Struts, or JSF. But the most common and used framework currently is Spring, while Struts and JSF are less used. So in conclusion, both Servlet and JSP are prerequisites to any web development in Java. About the instructor. My name is Kerim Mahmoud. I work as a Java technical lead, IBM portal, and BPM consultant. I have a bachelor's and a master's degree in computer science. I have 13 plus years of experience in software development and more than eight years as an instructor. I am well experienced in Java Spring and IBM products like IBM BPM, IBM WebSphere Portal, and IBM FileNet. Questions and support. If you ever have a question during this course, this platform has a feature that enables you to contact the instructor. I actively respond within 24 hours to questions, so do not hesitate to ask. If you have a question, simply contact me and I will gladly respond. There is another feature in the platform for whoever wants to withdraw from the course and get a refund. You can do that within 30 days. This won't be an issue. So, let's start this course.